happening everybody welcome back to the channel if you're keto i'm john hope you guys are having a great morning it is beautiful out here a little bit chilly but i'm getting ready to go hit the gym and run a few errands as you can see i did get my coffee gotta have some starbucks to go run a few of these errands uh anyways we're gonna kick this vlog off in a minute but first if you haven't already hit that subscribe click that subscribe hit that bell so that you're notified when i put out future videos also guys if you haven't joined up already go ahead and head over to our facebook group called if your keto community it's always linked in my description we're more than well you are more than welcome there we would love to hear your keto experiences and just your journeys so we'll talk to you guys soon what's going on you guys okay i'm going to show you how to make a deconstructed sushi roll so i'm craving sushi i've got some cauliflower rice you just get this frozen um, at your local grocery store and i microwaved it tried to pat it dry and then I put a, about a half a block of cream cheese in there to uh, soften that, put it back in the microwave, softened it, got it all incorporated nicely. Then I slicely, uh, thinned, or <laughs> thin sliced my uh, tuna. And all I did was add a little bit of uh, soy sauce to this, a little bit of garlic powder, and a little lemon juice. Then I had Lindsay julienne some cucumbers and carrots, so that's just a real thin slice. And I sliced an avocado. So I'm gonna go ahead and build this. Uh, we also got some crab meat back here that I shredded and then mixed with um, some spicy mayo. So what I'm gonna do is just start with my cauliflower rice. I'm gonna make like a bed and I probably should have pat this dry a little better, but I was impatient and you can use as little or as much uh, cream cheese as you would like to get the right consistency for the rice then we're just going to lay on some of that tuna that's been marinated in that soy sauce garlic powder and lemon juice man it smells really good it's good protein Cream cheese has some fat. Avocados have some good fat in them. Lindsay's not a huge fan of avocados, so I'm just gonna give her a few slices. I love avocado. I don't know what's wrong with that woman. <laughs> just kidding, guys. This is pretty much everything that you would put into a sushi, a spicy tuna roll. I'm gonna put some of these cucumbers in here and carrots for color. Not a whole lot. Yeah, guys, I understand that there's gonna be some carbs in the carrots. We're not going to go too crazy with it. Just want to add some color to it. And then I'm going to add some of this crab meat. Lindsay's fave. Oops. All right. And then, of course, you know we need to add some spicy mayo on there. So we are going to drizzle some of this spicy mayo right on top. And it's going to be so delicious. Me, myself, I love wasabi. So I'm going to put a little bit of wasabi on the side here. I don't think Lindsay really likes it. Baby, you want some wasabi? It's a baby spot. A little baby spot for the plate just to look nicely. You want to get a close-up of that. And you guys, you can interchange some ingredients that you want to add to this or take away. Whatever. It's not that big of a deal. Whatever you want to put on that plate, deconstructed sushi roll. Quick and easy, didn't take us long at all to prepare it. I'm hungry, so we're gonna dig into this. We'll talk to you guys soon. Uh, if you haven't already hit that subscribe, click that subscribe, guys. I'm sure that icon's going off. You can get click on the icon and get subscribed to this channel. Thank you all so much who are subscribed. Life's too short, so have a fantastic night.